Now the next four bars of the bridge, we're back to the G major 7, but this time we're going to bar it and we're going to not go flat across, but we'll just put these two fingers here down on the G and the B, and we will actually fret the fourth fret there under the bar. Four chords from the D on down, four strings. Then we'll roll down and grab that with the pinky, grab the sixth fret of the E string, and come over here to grab the fifth, the seventh fret of the B string. Then a B flat minor seven, and then bring down this finger here on the B string on the seventh fret. Quick up to the 11th fret, just barring straight across from the A on down and putting this finger on the B string at the 12th fret. That's an A flat minor with a, a, a fourth or an 11th. And then the D flat, now we're doing it up here at the 9th fret. 9, 9, 10, and then 11, 12 on the B and E. Nice full chord straight across. I'm muting the A the way I grip it. Uh, you could bar it, but then you have to figure out what to do with the A, or you could just forget the low A. And then I bring that down to a D flat with a raised fifth. So here I've got the these three fingers are on the uh, ninth fret, and the, these two come down on the tenth fret of the G and the B. Gives a kind of a diminished, kind of old-fashioned jazz sound. So uh, this phrase.